y'all welcome back to the channel um, before we get started make sure y'all hit that like button for me and subscribe to the channel if you're new and turn that post notification bell to all so y'all be notified when I drop now in this video y'all seen by the title I got a new alternator so we're gonna be throwing the alternator onto the 87 cutlass on my t-top cutlass to try and so so basically this is basically the first start of me getting ready to move it from where it's at so I can have my cars closer together instead of so far apart so that's what we're gonna be doing today we're gonna be throwing the alternator on then the next video y'all gonna be seeing a new vehicle and we're gonna be test fitting some wheels so that's a little heads up for y'all so hopefully hopefully y'all enjoyed this one and y'all enjoyed that one um Oh, we gotta throw some I got some battery turn top post terminals too so we gotta throw these on there and then I got the alternator down there so we gotta throw that on I got some transmission fluid we gotta throw that in there hopefully it starts again because last time I came out here I didn't record I should have but last time I came out here I couldn't get the car to start now I think it's because the alternator ran the battery down on the battery dead so that's what we're gonna be doing today I should have some jumper cables inside the cutlass then once we move it, I gotta throw the fuel pump on because it's hard for me to get it while it's in all this mud and dirt and stuff. So I'm gonna move it to some concrete and we're gonna try to throw that fuel pump on. And I'm gonna wash it. So we got a couple things coming. It's just the weather been so cold. So it's been hard for me to really get out and do a lot of stuff. So we got a couple things coming like I was saying. Got the fuel pump and we're gonna install that later on throwing the alternator in it out. I'm gonna try to anyway since it's gonna, it's gonna be my first time doing it. So I'm gonna try and do that today. Um, what else? I'm gonna be test fitting some wheels on the cutlass. I got a set of 22s already that was on this charger that should fit. Uh, what else? I think that's it. Mechanically, that's it. It's just the alternator and the fuel pump and I need to change the oil and I'm gonna try and tune it myself. I don't know if how that's gonna go, but I'm gonna try and tune it myself. So that's another thing we're gonna have coming and then that's really it the alternator supposed to be getting put onto the box that's why i gotta keep hooking it up unplugging it y'all might not have knew that but somebody else gonna do it he told me to do it for free so i'm gonna let him do it and i'm gonna try and do this one today myself hopefully we can get it done but that's really it all we got planned mechanically oh and i got some fuel injector too so I need to throw that in there too. I was going to drain the, all the gas out, but my pops was like, just leave it in there. It should be fine. Just throw this fuel injector in from Lucas. So hopefully that'll be fine, but we're going to throw this top post terminal on. And I'm going to try and see if I can do the alternate by myself. If not, it's going to be a waste of a video. But like I was saying before, I'm trying to record anything. Whatever I record, I'm just going to post it and say forget it. Because I, I, I'm so close to being monetized. So I'm going to just keep posting and dropping. And I'm sorry I took that break. Didn't want to, but I just didn't have nothing to record, really. Oh, and um, I got a Euro grill, too. My dad said we got one. So Monday, y'all getting this video Tuesday. So the day before I drop this video, I'm getting that. I'm going to get the Euro grill. My dad said it's put up, so we got to go get it. So, And I got... Let me show y'all, too got some tail lights too so i'm gonna be changing them out because i think the ones i got now have a crack in them which really to me ain't no big deal but my pops is like if you're gonna do it all you might as well do it all so we're gonna be doing that too but not today i'm gonna wait until i get the euro grill once i get that grill that euro bumper i'm gonna do that and throw the tail lights in too so i'm finna great take, take this thumbnail picture y'all already seen it but Finger eight, take that, uncover the car. I catch on one second once I agree to throw the top post terminals on. All right, y'all. So, first, I'm a since I bought this I already. I have to take this off. Hold on. Since I had bought this, I had bought this wire like this, I'm gonna have to cut it so I can fit these on there. And this one, I can just take this one off and stick it on. But let me go ahead and get ready to do that. I'm gonna have to cut the ground wire and the power wire. I should be able just to get it on. 
and I don't even know if I got any wire cutters with me but we're gonna figure out and see what we need to do My bad too if I don't talk a lot. I'm trying to get this done. quiet on y'all don't, don't don't take it out on me my apologies that's the only thing bro I put that junk on tight Not harder. I think I was always taught no cap. I'm so freaking slow. And the alternate might take a little longer, so this might be a really long video. If not, I'm going to speed it up while I'm doing it. I need to get some new wire though, for real. I'm gonna have to try and cut this. I don't have no wire cutters. Hold on. It's wiggling, hold on. Come on, come on. Uh. 
And I'm still gonna have to get some wire cutters. It's wiggling though. As y'all can see, I got a lot of it. Got it. Oh. Shoot. I didn't bring none of the right tools, and that's on me. I was too busy in a rush, because I'm trying to get a video for y'all with anything. I hate going so many days without posting, you know, because one day a video will do really good, so if I stay more consistent, they'll do really good more. But then I don't have nothing to record, and that's what really be messing me up. I can squeeze this in there. Come on. Come on. God dang. I want to try to crank it up, see if it'll start without putting the alternator on real quick. So let me throw these on the battery and I'm going to come back to y'all in one second. All right, y'all, I ain't feel like putting it on my tripod, but as y'all can see, we got them on. I ain't feel like putting it on my tripod, putting the camera on my tripod, so I'm just going to hold it with my hand. Ooh. I just want to try it real quick. Before we get started, yeah, the battery dead. Uh uh, battery dead. So I'm finna see if I can try and get this alternator done real quick. So it's gonna be a lot, and it's my first time doing one. So we're gonna see how this go. Yeah, we gonna see how it is going to take the battery back off. Catch y'all in a minute. All right, so I've been looking a couple minutes. I was like, bro, where the freak is the alternator? So I looked online. I was like, where's the alternator supposed to be at? And it's supposed to be on this side, right? Ain't no alternator even in here, bro. I kept looking, I was like, bro, oh yeah, here go, here go the new one I got. I was like, bro, where's the alternator supposed to be? And I was like, and it's supposed to have a plug with it. So I came to this side, went online, was like, okay, where's the alternator supposed to be at? It's supposed to be right here, and here go the plug. It ain't even no alternator in here. So, we finna try and go ahead and get ready to get this installed. I might show y'all while I'm doing it, but this is probably gonna take me a little minute. And I just, I was wondering why there was a missing belt the entire time. Like why the belt was inside the car. 
So I'll just put that through there. So yeah, um, I'm probably not gonna make y'all watch this part. I'm probably just gonna try and do it myself. Um, Cause I really don't know how long this is gonna take. But like I was saying, we got the new alternator. As y'all see it in the thumbnail. Brand new and my hands already dirty. But in my clothes, but we be all right. So I'm gonna try to do this. I don't know if I'm gonna, I'm, I'm not gonna make y'all watch this. Cause it's probably gonna take me a minute myself. Cause this, like I said before, this is my first time doing this. So I'm gonna try to do this by myself. I ain't gonna have the camera on. But once I got somewhat installed to where I think it's installed, I'm gonna come back to y'all and turn the camera on. So give me, give me a second. All right, so I wanted to update y'all before we move, before I move any further. God dang it, just dropped the keys. So, I basically got it on. I just gotta go and get another bolt. As y'all can see, I put a brand new bolt on there. Now I found one more bolt to put down here at the bottom. But, got it on, got it plugged up. Now, I did all this by myself too. Didn't look up nothing because everything I looked up didn't help. So, did this all by myself. I wonder if y'all can see me. But, yeah, I gotta go find another boat that's long enough to go all the way through so I can hold the back in and keep the belt tight. So, yeah, I just wanted to update y'all, give y'all a little update, tell y'all where I'm at and what's going on. And I ain't got no loose bolts. I can look through all my toolboxes, everything I got on me. So I don't have nothing loose, but y'all can see. Bought some bolts. Gotta find another one though. That's where I'm stuck at though. But everything should be hooked up right. Got everything on. Just gotta find a bolt and a nut to put on there. So I just wanted to update y'all. Come back to y'all in a minute. All right, y'all, so we on, we bolted. I just got to put the cable, the battery cable wire on or the battery ground wire on. I got the alternator hooked up. Like I said, it's my first time doing it, but it's really nothing but two bolts. And then you got to put the plug in. So I'm finna get ready to hook the battery up. Once I hook the battery up, we're going to try and start it. And when I tell you, I've been going through trouble. I've been on this for like three hours because every time I got ready to do it, I couldn't find a boat. I needed two boats, as y'all can see, brand new boat. So I had to go to the store and try and find one. And AutoZone didn't have it. So I had to go to O'Reilly's. Then I had to try to make do with what I had. So I just been struggling and struggling. But we finna go ahead, we finna get to bolt up the battery. Let me see if this one is. Tools out. I'm too big of in a rush. Nope. This is some bull. Been working on this car all day, and everybody want to ask me for rides, bro. I'm trying to do something for me right now. Just gonna hand tighten it because we gotta take it off anyway. Can't leave it on. Take this out. Should be everything. I ain't put no gas treatment in it yet. But we finna go ahead and try and crank it. Alright, here we go. Let's see what it do. I still gotta put a fuel pump on her too.
think the battery dead. I'm gonna have to put it. I'm gonna jump it off. Yep. Yeah. All right, so. I'm gonna go ahead and try and jump this off real quick. Give me a second. All right, we got the, the battery cables on. We jump the cables. Gonna try and jump it on. That charger looking good. Gonna try and jump off the T-top cutlass. I hope it worked. There you go, see? Start right up, man. Start right up, bro. Make sure I don't got no cover. Like I was saying, the tail lights, I gotta get the tail light. So I, I mean, I got them, I just gotta put them on. Doing some popping, I don't know what that is. But look, man, we got it. We put an alternator on. I can turn the charger off now. Ooh. My car stay on E. I'll stay pushing it to the limit. It don't make no sense. It should start up every time now. I just gotta get a fuel pump, bro. I think I gotta tighten that belt too. I might have to tighten it up a little more. call my pops all right i'm gonna come back to y'all in a minute all right y'all that's gonna be it for this one i gotta take the battery take it to go get charged up because battery keep dying out so i'm pretty sure it's just a battery dead but yeah i hope y'all enjoyed this we put on the alternator next step we're gonna move it and i'm gonna wash it and i'm gonna throw the fuel pump on it and i'm gonna test fit some wheels because Y'all know me, I like cosmetic things like wheels, radio, and all that stuff. So, I gotta get my tags on it too. I was waiting to do the tags until I knew it was good. So now that I know that I got the alternator running and it start up fine on its own, like one crank. Um, I'm gonna go get the tags done. Go get some insurance on it, all that stuff. Y'all know how it go. Now, I got three cars that's running really this summer dog this summer we finna turn up though for real um the next video like i was saying y'all gonna see me test fitting some wheels on the new car that me and my pops got so y'all gonna see that next make sure y'all stay tuned hit that like button hit that like button my bad hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you're new turn the post notification bell to all and yeah man we finna turn up this year i'm almost monetized so y'all keep sharing the channel and we finna grow together I hope y'all enjoyed this like I said at first. We got a lot of good things coming. I'll catch y'all on the next one.